What is up you guys? Welcome back to my channel. My name is Maria. If this is the first time you're tuning in, welcome. Today I wanted to share with y'all some of the items that I found at Dollar Tree pertaining to fall and Halloween season. Let me know if y'all like this style of video. Let's get started. So first off, they had a ton of little wall decor. They had little pillows. They had stickers. They had just about everything. There's more stuff coming out as we speak, except they still have some of the school items out. So with that in mind, Mind, you know that space is gonna be covered by Halloween and fall items so I'm so excited I did see some of the Christmas stuff start to come out so mm, I don't know about that but let's look at some of these fall and Halloween items they had all these pumpkins literally I cannot get over how many pumpkins they have there's literally something for everybody and mind you you can put little initials on these if you so wish to and give them out as like friendship gifts or something there's a lot of creativity here to be played with they also had some signs from last year and pardon me but i kind of repeated some images in this video so you're gonna see a couple of the same ones or similar ones i didn't overdo it they had a ton of cute little halloween signs spiders if you're into that i'm, I'm definitely scared of spiders wooden cutouts little day of the dead sculptures so many items definitely check out your local dollar tree and i know a lot of them are still coming out with items so please bear that in mind don't be mean to the associates but here are a couple of the more items, stickers. Pillows, more pillows. Here's a closer view of those pillows. Here are some of the wooden laser cutouts. These are definitely worth it. Definitely check these out. There's a lot of crafts being done with them on TikTok. Highly recommend that you peep some videos there for some DIY creativities. These bows are absolutely gorgeous. You can pop them onto a pumpkin or the little spooky Christmas tree that they have going on. They have these little cute wooden cutouts if you wanna do more specific type crafts or just paint over them or bleach them onto a shirt like a lot of people on TikTok are doing. I personally love the wooden cutouts that Dollar Tree came out with this year. They're just so adorable and for the price you cannot beat them. They are pretty thin so you need to be mindful when it comes to bending them. They might break but overall the quality is pretty good. For a dollar you cannot do better honestly. Here are some of the cute ones. These are the coffins. It says trick or treat. And then they also have the pumpkin one. And then my personal favorites were these little day of the dead heads. I love painting over these. These are just a great little cute activity. There's so many things to paint over with the wooden items and the ceramic ones as well. So just check them out. There's LED projectors as well. I would kind of skip over those in my opinion. They had things to decorate the spooky Christmas tree, more wooden cutouts, um, but overall, love it, love it. One of my favorite Dollar Tree Halloween items has to be these three witch boots. These are so adorable. They can go practically anywhere and they remind me so much of Hocus Pocus, which is the theme that I'm going for this year. So they were perfect right up my alley. This is kind of an overall view of that Halloween section. They were still stocking up. Manager said they were going to bring in more items, but this is kind of the overall view of it. There's so many stickers as well if you're into that. Now going down the fall section, they had a ton of signs still at this particular location. I know my other ones were really, really slim pickings. They have so many fall flowers as well. These are really, really great for any DIY or room decor that you're trying to create this fall and Halloween season. As you can see, they have some of those little signs that they had last year, which are pretty okay. Like you can always strip them and redo them however which way you please. And Dollar Tree supplies all of the crafts you need to redo these. My absolute favorites had to be the little letters, the pumpkins. 
These wooden cutouts are okay if you're into trucks, get that little truck with the pumpkins on top. These little jug laser cutouts, absolutely beautiful. These little signs here, they're okay. Like, you know, they're cute to mount on like maybe a little wall or something. They're adorable. These little pillows I for sure picked up and I put them next to my dog's bed. I just thought they were the perfect size. They're made out of cotton, nothing dangerous. There's a go. They also had these checkered pumpkins. I know they had the black and white one, but that one always runs out so fast. They also had these velvet faux, faux, faux velvet pumpkins in different colors. Absolutely gorgeous. I picked up a couple more signs, but this is a picture. And the ribbons. Definitely pick up the checkered ribbons because those are flying off the shelves. You could use those for fall, Christmas, you name it. These shattered glass pumpkins are so adorable. Cute, they're cute. And then they had these little accent flowers and stuff. I picked up a gray pumpkin. It reminded me of Cinderella for some reason. I don't know. They also had the leaves just by themselves without the stems. They had more of these little cute wooden cutouts so you can paint over them. I've seen people on TikTok actually putting those wooden pieces on top of like a black shirt, black orange shirt. And then they spray the whole, what is it called? They spray bleach and it looks absolutely cool. Here are the ribbons that I was talking about. Definitely pick them up. These are wired. But here are more of the signs. They had some mini hay bells and they also have the larger ones. They had the faux corn. Also some of these fall ceramics that you can paint over. These are so cute. I didn't pick any of these up because I'm, oh, actually no, I did pick up the pumpkin, my bad. But they also had the hay man. Here's another look at the Halloween stuff. The Halloween trees are another popular item. Keep your eye out. The little pumpkins. So here are just some general pictures of some of those fall items that I found. There's so many. If your Dollar Tree has not gotten any of the fall or Halloween items at your store, I would for sure try and see if the associate knows or if the manager knows. They most likely have heard whether or not they're going to get things at least within the next week. I know they can't always say like, yeah, I'm getting this exact item, but they can at least tell you, oh yeah, shipment's coming in on Tuesday or Wednesday. So if you have any doubt about that, just ask, you know, the worst thing you can hear is no, I don't know, you know, so... But these are some of the cute items that I would for sure pick up at Dolly Tree. Again, let me know if you guys like this style of video. I know it's kind of all over the place. <laughs> but here's just another look at these items. And this was actually at my bigger Dollar Tree. I was there right as the shipment came in. So I was able to look at some of the stuff right away. And I opened a couple of the boxes. I was not messy with it. I was trying to help the associates as well because opening up boxes is a beat. Yeah, I made a friend actually, and we were just looking at every single thing. We lasted maybe three hours at the Dollar Tree, just figuring out what items we wanted. And we actually missed a box of beads. We beat ourselves up after it, but she found the box after it was emptied and we're like darn we missed an opportunity to get beads but um we've been on the hunt for more beads i grabbed three at a previous location that from a tiktok that i had showed y'alls but i wasn't trying to be a hoarder with all of them so i only picked up three i only picked up what i needed But here's a picture of us just going through the boxes. Um, there were a ton of bouquets, ton of items that I just showed y'all in those last clips. The ribbons. This was before I went to the Dollar Tree where I filmed everything that I just filmed. But these were some of the items that I got. I also got these like stickers for mugs. We'll see if that works. They had so many cute stickers. You can put these on black 
boards and get really creative with it you don't have to go all out but there are some simple things that you can place on top of other things that'll make it look really really nice but they just had an array of items dollar tree is truly the spot to go to the things you'll find at dollar tree for the fall and halloween season are moderately sized so if you're looking for say bigger pumpkins like the ones that are giant you might want to check out other stores like michael's or marshall's tj maxx um hobby lobby if you're comfortable in going like all these other things all these other places that offer a little bit more bigger in size but dollar tree is definitely the place to go if you're just looking for little nicks and tricks to getting around the fall and halloween season and not overspending at least like not spending 500 dollars on just decorations they have really great items to just spruce up your little vanity or your little desk or your little nightstand whatever or your bathroom you can really just get super creative with these little items i personally love shopping at the Dollar Tree because everything's just a dollar. Unless you have a Dollar Tree Plus, then of course you have items ranging up to five dollars but to each their own there's just so many cute items and for this halloween season yeah might as well just stop at the dollar tree you know so yeah i hope y'all enjoy this little video let me know what you guys think do you want me to make more of these videos i'm probably gonna record more of these at dollar tree but i'm not gonna do as many pictures so that way y'all don't get as bored hopefully hopefully this wasn't too boring but there's just my little a little video and i will be hauling all the stuff that i got i've just been having some health issues so i'm trying to get that sorted out but yeah thank you so much for tuning in and i will see you guys in my next video bye